Hello guys, welcome to today's video by Trust Stanley and this is a TS Tech Talks video. On today's video guys, I'm going to show you how to add group rules on your Facebook group. So if you run a Facebook group and you want to add rules to the users that are entering the group so that they will know the group rules to follow or the guideline of the group to follow in order not to um, abuse the use of the Facebook group that you manage. Now, this is an easy way to remind people before joining the group so um if you guys want to create stuff like that before you be able to create stuff like that notice that you have to be an admin of the page and you also have to manage the page as an admin before you'll be able to add all of these now if you want to do that go ahead and click on the group icon and open the group that you want to add the group rules to now i'm going to click on this first um group right there which is main ts tech and then wait for it to load. Uh, most time it might take a while, depending on your Facebook, um, your internet speed. Okay, once it loads, just on the left-hand area, go ahead and scroll down. You're going to notice where it says group rules, right there. You notice where it says group rules, right? Click on the group rules to create a group rules. Now you notice where it says getting started. But before you click on the getting started, you can notice where it says no group rules set up, right? Use the group rule to head set up to help set up the tone of your group and help prevent members conflict write up to 10 rules without um 10 rules about your group so in order to write this go ahead and click on getting started now it's going to automatically bring you to this page where you'll be able to enter the title and the description of your rule but there are some uh, um there are some information right here all these ones are an example of the group rules so um if for some reason you guys are okay with any of these, go ahead and click on it. And I'm actually going to click on this first one. So this first one will give you the title and the description. So all you need to do is to go ahead and read the group rule right there. It says be kind and cautious. Um, this information also, go ahead and read it. And if you are satisfied with it, go ahead and click on create and it will create the group rule. Now you notice we have one group rule, right? Now let's go ahead and create even more. All you need to do is to tap to select and then click. So I'm going to do that repeatedly till I add the whole four of them. And then that create. And I'm going to add even one more. Now click on create once more. And I'm going to write here and say, oh, I wanted to say no spamming. There is already no spamming and okay. Um, let me just add this just in case anybody wants to add manually and do not know how to do that. Although it's already staring at you. So let me just say. All right. So if this information is good enough for you, go ahead and click on create and it will be created. You see right there. The number five rule now if for some reason guys you you do not want the arrangement to be like this like this one that is on number five you decide to put it on top all you need to do is to click on this area you notice it has this hand stuff so you can drag it up 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 to the first area and then you notice it changed to number one and then um this be kind you can drag it to the third place and then it will change to number three so if for some reason you want to shuffle it, that is just how you do it in order for you to shuffle it. And then let's go over to the home page so that you see how this displays. Usually it should display on the left hand area. And then after the right, left hand area, it should also display when somebody tries to join the group. Instead of waiting for it to display right there, let me just click on the about section on this area. Click on the about. Just We just want to confirm that it's displaying. And then scroll right down. Keep scrolling. You should see the group rules now there you go this is the group rules that we just created and you can notice all the information are just exactly the way they um, we want them to be so if for some reason you can click on this to um to drop down to close it and you can click to open it also so in order for us to further confirm this also mind the name of the group is actually main ts tech right now i'm going to log out and log into a different profile so that i'll show you guys how this also work and and then we move on all right so 
I have to log into a different Facebook account in order to test if this actually works properly. Now I need to search for group. I have to search the exact group that I created the question and answer for, which is actually main CS tech. So I need to click on this group icon right there. And then search for the group. Only group. I just have to show you guys that this actually shows that information when somebody tries to join. So I just click on the main group and now you notice the join icon. Now let's say I want to join the group. When you click on the join group, it should give you the terms of use normally. And then you need to accept the terms of use. And I think I'm already friend with him. so. I didn't see the terms of use, but usually it's supposed to show the terms of use. And then when you click on the about, you also see the terms of use and you need to accept the terms of use before you be able to join the group. But for some reason, I think I'm actually friend with um, the, um, the account owner of this group. That's the reason why he didn't ask for those details. So there is nothing much. Everything should be working perfect. And on my next video, guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create question and answer for your Facebook um, group. So I just want to confirm that this works fine. And it also works fine because they are all here. But I'm going to be showing you more interesting features on my next video. So make sure you guys stay subscribed to the channel for more video. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and share the video with your friends. For more video, please come back for more video. And if for some reason you want to check out my playlist, you can check out the playlist for the Facebook group and there are more videos there. Peace. See you guys soon.